Leader of the main opposition United Progressive Party, Harold Lovell, was euphoric as he and his party supporters entered the grounds of the nomination center, the Princess Margaret School. His mission, to secure nomination as his party's candidate for St. John City East in the next general elections. As he completed the process, he would have been mindful of having previously served as Member of Parliament for the constituency. Now, having spent two terms in the electoral wilderness, Mr. Lovell is confident he is back stronger than ever. I served this community for 10 years and I lost favor with some persons and you know the democratic process is such that they wanted to tell me, look, come better next time. So I have listened and I've been able to build a lot of bridges, mend a lot of fences, I've been able to build the love and right now the love is very strong. I'm happy with the turnout and um, I'm sure even at your most subjective best, you would say that the energy is good. Not only is he confident of winning his seat, but Lovell says the United Progressive Party, the UPP, has what it takes to win the January 18, 2023 elections. We've seen a very noticeable shift um, in voter support. We've done a lot of polling, and we know where we were three years ago. We know where we are now. So it's just for us to consolidate the gains that we've made and to continue to put a very strong people-centered message to the people and that's really what we're all about because our mantra is people first. As for what the party will do over the next three weeks to convince the electorate, this is Mr. Lovell's plan. It's full political swing now and so we're all in and we're very very happy the energy is as we expected because it's been a long campaign and we realize that it's a campaign that would have to vary its pace and so we have been able to vary our pace to test our strength and we are satisfied that we are at that point now where once we get our rallies going, once we get our other mobilization efforts going, that the energy is going to be very strong, very powerful and we're going to win this election. The United Progressive Party successfully nominated 16 candidates on Antigua Wednesday. The party is aligned with the Barbuda's People's Movement on the Sister Isle. That party nominated incumbent candidate Trevor Walker as its nominee. For ABS News, I'm Ursula Charles Jr.